Hello, sweetheart. That's a little ding on her nose there. Yep. See? Let's just look at you on here. So the smell? They're gorgeous. The babies smell beautiful. So what's that little smell? smell? That sweet smell of baby bat. That nice sweet aroma. That's baby grey-headed flying fox. Oh, um, so adults, flying fox. adults are different. And blacks are different. She's a grey-headed flying fox. Give me your toes, sweetheart. You're another little girl. I make six girls in a row that I've rescued. I forgot my, to get a dummy. What's wrong? What have you done? Apart from being dehydrated. There, was I'm there any story? No, no story. I can get water. It's all right. I've got um, some subcut fluids. Look, these are her baby teeth. See mm -hmm. how they're tiny little backwards curving teeth? Mm -hmm. That's her adult teeth just starting to erupt, that one mm -hmm. back near my thumbnail. Mm -hmm. And her baby bumps, she hasn't got those ones, so they've started to come down. There's teeth there in, in the top jaw. Oh, so the teeth are baby bumps. Yeah, the point. baby bumps under their nose. There's right. just little baby bumps. Uh, you hold on to me, sweetheart. Don't, I need you to hold on to me. When they're this age, they've got extra sharp little barbs under their claws that help them hang on to mum. Now, are you using that? Yes, you are. Good girl. That one there. And is that a wee? That's a little tiny bit of wee. So how do you know she's a girl? No, boy bits. That's girl. So you see testes? Or well, you, and you would see, that's penis clitoral well. hood, you'd see the penis. Yeah, the penises are quite obvious when they're not... Um, when they're really young. That's some glucose. What's that? Oh, very, very yummy. So it's glucose gel, which means if they're not great at swallowing. Hello, little girl. So you've dinged your nose. Have you got any fractures along here? Let me have a look. Nothing there, nothing swollen. Hello, baby. What about this one? Nothing swollen. Thumbs working. Baby, you're gorgeous. I had a 50-50 chance of getting it right, and I got you a blue one. <laughs> Here. Put your bits on that. Put your bits on that. Hold on to the mama. We call them mummies, mummy rolls. Oh, I see. And, now, and if I do this and I put the corner of this in her mouth, she'll treat it like a dummy. Mm -hmm. There we are. Bye. Oh, that's just really, really good. You're really good at this. I've been doing it for a while. And I just give it, she looks like she's about 100 grams, so mm -hmm. I'll give her 10% sub cut. So if they bite you, what are you worried about? Um, rabies. Astra rabies? Rabies? Astra we don't have rabies here. No, but we? we have Australian this a virus, which is one of the rabies family of viruses. I see. It's the Australian uh, version. Europe's got European bat virus. A virus, yeah. Yeah, lissa virus, yep. ABLV lissa virus. And we can get that? Yep, from a bite or a scratch. If she's licked her claws, which it's really unlikely, then a scratch can transmit it if she's sick. There's fewer than 1% of the, um, the bats may carry the virus, mm -hmm. and it usually kills them fairly quickly once mm -hmm. they're infected. In order to pass an infection, the bat has to be actively shedding the virus from its brain at the time that you're bitten or scratched. The virus has to be present in the saliva at the time you're bitten or scratched, mm -hmm. and the saliva has to contact your, a nerve ending. Oh, I understand. Okay, so, okay. But so she's dinged her face. She's, she, that, see, that hurts her. See? That what? That hurts her. Yeah, she yeah, doesn't yeah, like yeah, that yeah, at all. Yeah, yeah. And she's a bit swollen around her yeah, nose, but she's yeah. got no swellings in her wrists. Yeah. Um, oh, she's so much happier and see, now. Yeah, and see her, so well. see her eyes should be really bright and yeah. large. So yeah. that's dehydration. Yeah. I call it the squidgy look. Mm -hmm. She looks squidgy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll see how she goes. There's a little bit of blood mm -hmm. on that. So she's probably... Yeah, she she's, did she's, have a bit of blood in yeah, there. Yeah, see, she's got... Yeah. She's just bitten her, or she's just yeah. bumped her yeah. jaw, her gums. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Really good. I'm really impressed. Isn't she pretty? Yeah. Aren't you gorgeous, sweetheart? Yeah, you know, I'd hate to say it, but a lot of vets would have just put her down. Well, a lot of vets wouldn't touch her. 
blood and you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I didn't want to okay, do the that. wrong thing, but um, that's why I said. You can even call us in the middle of the night. We, we go out at 2am yeah. if necessary. Yeah. Squidgy. She may have a brain injury. Mm. I don't know. I don't think so. But the adrenaline she's at this stage. She's responsive and she's yeah. been sort of with me. But they might be and then they have a brain bleed yeah, and then they just die overnight. Yeah. But She's see. not worth euthanizing now. I mean, oh, no. No, 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 no. We don't euthanize you, do you? Unless you've got something that will mean that you can, can't be released. We'll see how she goes. I've got an incubator in the car, so she'll warm up. Mm -hmm. We keep them warm. Like even just putting a heat pad under the box or something like that. Because okay. she's a baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. She's a baby. Hey, beautiful. How old is she here? Okay. Um, let me have a look. She's got fur on her belly, so she looks like she's between three and four weeks old. Oh, wow, and her, her teeth are coming in. Yeah. And that's the length of her foot. That's the length of her forearm. So she looks just over three weeks old. Wow. It's very young, isn't it? Yeah. And but I have to measure the forearm, and there's for a graph. To be able to be released? About five months. Five but months. she'll be about five months old, so another four months mm -hmm. or so. So does someone have to keep her in that sort of situation? Uh, well, she's a baby at the moment, so she's like yeah. that. But in a week or two, I'm going to pop her onto an era and she'll hang. Actually, right. somebody else will probably take her because yeah. I've got too many. Let me have a look. Let me have a look, sweetheart. Oh, nice. She's just slightly dinged a gum, look, see? So that's what's bleeding. Oh, she's just smacked good. in her face, yeah. that's all. Yeah, look, that's, that's a new tooth, look, that's a, an it adult is. tooth that's coming. It is. Isn't it? Look, aunt. Look at that. Yes, and the little baby ones at the bottom. Okay, let's give you some more glucose. Bubba? Another girl, as we do. Of course. Yeah. That's six dots. Okay, so I've given her some subcut fluids and I've got some analgesia from the vet for her. Yeah. And I'm just going to weigh and measure her. There we are. And I've had a brief look at her at the vet. Right. It's okay. Hey baby. And she's still cold even though she's been in the incubator. Now what's she done there? Oh bugger. I think she's got a fracture in her wrist. Yeah. There. Okay. See, she's dinged yeah. it in there. Okay, baby, you're going to stay with me, honey? You're going to stay with me? Yeah, I'll go and get an x-ray for you, but I can't do it now. Because Vicky's not on. Vicky the vet nurse, we love Vicky the vet nurse. So I'm not sending her. Hello, baby. Yeah, we'll get you something for pain, sweetie. We will. Here we are, sweetheart. One oh seven, and she's had ten mils of fluid, so that's ninety-seven. Have they all been fed yet? Yeah. Oh, good. We're starting to pack them up. I'm just going to measure this one, won't I, sweetheart? Okay, 84. So that's three and a half weeks. So I've just given her something for pain. And you can see that she's got a little ding under her eye and her nose looks like it's been slashed a little. Could be a bird attack. Or it could be that she hit her nose. She's also hit a wrist. I'm just putting some um, stuff that stops, reduces swelling and bruising. And we'll see if we can um, 
make it more comfortable for her until we can get an x-ray tomorrow. It's not critical we get an x-ray today. Okay, see now I've given her a drink. She's got swelling up that wrist. There we are, baby. Bit of swelling in her thumb, the base of her thumb. So now I'm just gonna pop her into the incubator and she can have a proper sleep. There we are. There we are, baby.